shot, an unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air. And the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high, and every expectation that this game will live up to its considerable billing. Live coverage right here on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's France, and they take on Belgium. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch. Rabiot! He can't hold on to it. Oh, I can't believe it! He's gone and missed the chance! Well, what a glorious chance that was. One he should be taking, that's for sure. Here's the side France will go with. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good but it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. He's in behind. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So the action underway again. And the onus is on Belgium to come up with a response now. Tielemans. Clean challenge. Oh, great defending. And it was turned out, so a throw-in will be next. Rabio And beating the defender. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, just look how Koeman glides past the defender. And the finish from Koeman is excellent. He hits it with such power and accuracy. No chance for the keeper. So, back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Kevin De Bruyne. And now with Luka Bakio. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. He's in here. Thwarted by the post. Oh, that's splendid play. It has to be. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So the action continues, and France really beginning to run away with this now. The scoreline threatening to get ugly. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Olivier Giroud, and threading it through, and Coman's in here. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him.
Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and Coleman couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. And France exploiting the space on the flank. And delivered towards the back post. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Carrasco. De Bruyne now. Able to block it. Can he convert? Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals, what a good performance. And he's not finished just yet. The second half commences. It was such a one-sided first half. Might it be different this time round? Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Nicely cut out. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Coman. And oh, they've given him too much space. Antoine Griezmann waiting. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Griezmann. Oh, he fancies his chances. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And the referee playing advantage. Coman. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. And at one point on its flight, it looked as though it might be a goal. Well, he should have been hitting the target from there. He had enough time to get his shot away. I think that's a poor miss in the end. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. And while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. Well, take it away, he won the ball. Decisive in the tackle, and the throw in here. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. 
being pressed here. France doing well to regain possession. Olivier Giroud. And Coman has the chance. Oh, that is a superb save. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Giroud. Still could be dangerous. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Timing was perfect. Ball one. Castagna. Icoma Luis Openda. Now space for Belgium in the wide position. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. A good and fair challenge. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.